guys, it's Steph and welcome back to my channel. We got some wings. Stop. I am so excited to try this new chicken sandwich. Everyone that I've seen that has tried this chicken sandwich has said it is like the best chicken sandwich ever. So I went on the app to order it and it said they are sold out nationwide. But I was like, mm, I'm going to call. How could they be sold out of it? Like, not Popeyes all over again. <laughs> so I call and she's like, we do have some left. So I just got one. I got the garlic parmesan. I also got some wings, fries, and of course, corn. Ooh. Okay, got that. Oh, there's the chicken sandwich. It's corn. A big lump of knobs. It's got the juice. And then I also just got a 10 piece bone in garlic wings because I love wings. If I'm coming to Wings Step, I gotta get wings too. And then some ranch. This bag is so deep, like literally shoulder deep. Some more fries. So I just went in and picked it up. It is nice and hot and fresh. So let's take a look. Wow, that bun is beautiful. Check this out. So this looks really, really good. I got the garlic parm with pickles. Wow. So it doesn't have like a sauce on it, but I got ranch on the side and I also brought some hot sauce. <laughs> Let's take this, wow, this is like such a beautiful, oh, it's so hot. This is beautiful. Okay guys, this is the hot sauce I brought in case it needed it because since they were like running low on chicken sandwiches I didn't want to order like a ton so I was like I'll just get one and bring some hot sauce in case I want it it's Nashville hot but we're gonna dip it in some ranch and let's try this famous chicken sandwich out okay let's try Wow, wow, way better than Popeyes, way better than Wendy's, way better than Burger King, and I think Burger King is where my favorite one is. Wow, that is so juicy. Look at that, like, wow, this is so good. I can't tell if my camera's like glaring or not. Wow. It is so juicy. Like, it is just coating my whole chin in juice. Mmm. Wow. And they have good pickles, too. I usually don't like pickles on sandwiches, but those are good ones. Crunchy and really sour. That's how I like them. And I'm not even like a big chicken sandwich person but this mm. 10 out of 10 best one I've ever had it's crazy how everyone was like obsessing over the Popeyes one like yeah it was good but like What a great start to the day. I was so upset when I heard they didn't have it. I'm like, so upset. I was like, what do I do now? So that's all I wanted. I was like, oh, what else should I get? Today, my new refrigerator is coming and I'm so excited. So, the fridge that I have now is a Samsung fridge. I don't really recommend Samsung. If you have one and it's working great, good for you. Let's knock on wood. Um, don't have any wood, but I hope it continues to work for you. Mine came with my house. All the appliances did. And... 
I've had problems with it ever since. It shuts off randomly. Um, my dad like replaced some part, it didn't do anything. It continues to just turn off. And if I don't realize it's off, I have good fries. You guys yelled at me in the last wing stop video. You're like, why didn't you get the fries? These are good. Wow. So if I don't notice the fridge turns off, let's not stain my shirt, um, all the food goes bad in it. Uh, so I drink a lot of water, so I'm always going up to the fridge refilling my cup, and I'll notice it's off at least like three times a week and then I have to go into the creepy basement and like reset the breaker um, and then my ice maker just stopped working and everything in my freezer is just over freezing and it's not too full either so and I see lots of people with Samsung fridges I'm like I'm just going to maybe put it in the garage or give it away uh, put it on like Facebook marketplace or something and just say like, yeah, the ice maker doesn't really work and it shuts off sometimes, but maybe someone would still want it, you know? Uh, Cause it still works. You just have to be careful and pay attention to make sure it doesn't turn off. Mmm, look at that toasted bun. So my new fridge is coming today. And I've, I've never been so excited. I've been waiting for Friday. Like, I'm so excited. I know I'm getting old when I'm excited for a refrigerator to come. But you guys, it makes ball ice. Ball ice. Balls. Oh my gosh, the best ice is ever. Bice. The best ice shape ever. They're big balls too, like this big. <laughs> Mmm, that is so good. I can't believe it. Check out this cute new cup I got. Can't tell if the camera's blurry, guys. Let me reset it. Why does it look all like... Larry. Okay, I reset it. I don't know why it looks blurry to me unless it's just like my eyes. Mmm. It's corn. A big lump of knobs. That guy. That little boy is so cute. Like the cutest little boy with his like missing tooth. <laughs> He's so cute. And he was um hanging out with Mr. Beast, which is awesome. Mm. My dad's never had wing stop. He loves, he loves wings too. And he was like, I don't even know where to get good wings anymore. Like, I don't like them from any restaurants. I'm like, you gotta try Wingstop. Like, trust me, they're the best wings ever. But yeah, my new fridge, it makes ice out of the ice dispenser and then the balls are in the freezer. Um, so, super excited. I got it on sale, almost a thousand dollars off for on a Labor Day. They had a big sale, and then I also had to get a dishwasher because my dishwasher doesn't really work either. Um, the door like doesn't shut, and it always opens up and then stops the wash, or it opens up and it lands on Hershey's head. <laughs> no joke, it just opens up and it lands on her, and then she gets all scared and runs away, and I'm like, oh no, <laughs> like watch out, Hershey. She's like, what is this thing that keeps landing on my head? <laughs> of 
Corn is good. That kid is right. I've always loved corn. Like it's so, it is so juicy and crunchy and it's a vegetable. Mmm. So I'm going to do a video on my second channel, like reorganizing my new fridge and showing you guys the balls. Can't wait. Can't wait. Because I love ice. And then when the ice stopped working, I was like, no. And like, you can just use ice cube trays. No big deal. I like those as well. I used to use those all the time because then you could get the big cubes. <laughs> But it's because the fridge would just turn off and the food would go bad. That's like the, the main issue. And they told me they're coming between 2 and 6 o'clock. Like, I forgot I had these wings over here. I just want to get an up close shot. Look at those beauties. I always forget to order just flats. But I had to order on the phone, so I was like not prepared. Because when she told me they had them, but the app said like they didn't, I was like, oh shoot, can I place an order over the phone? And then I was like, what do I want? Um, but yeah, they told me I have to have everything out of the fridge so the guys can move it and stuff. But I'm like, I don't know what time you guys are coming. Like, that's a four hour time range. Like, if I take this stuff out at 2 and you guys don't get here till 6, the food's going to go bad. So I'm like, I don't know. I'm hoping they're just going to text me like, hey, we're on your, we're on the way. And then I'll just take the stuff out. Mmm. Garlic parm is my favorite flavor. You guys want to hear something so stupid that I did last night? Okay, last night was the first football game, NFL. So me and some friends went out to the bar to watch the game and get an appetizer had a few drinks it was ladies night so it was ladies night so it was three dollar Long Islands so I had a few of those I go home and I'm like okay the new iPhone comes out tonight to pre-order it And it said 5 a.m. Pacific time. So I'm like, okay, that's three hours behind. So I, I set my alarm when I went to bed and I set my alarm at 2 a.m. Three hours behind. No, it goes the other way, Stephanie. I was, a few, I was a few drinks in. <laughs> but, so I set my alarm, I wake up at 2 a.m., I go on the Apple store and I'm like, okay, it's, it's not showing it's available. I'm like, hello. And then I was like, oh, that is 8 a.m. <laughs> so me and her should go back to sleep. I like, couldn't sleep after that. I wake up at 8. Even though I was, I woke up at like six, and then I woke up at like seven, and then the, at that point I was just like awake. So I, I get it at eight. I, I was there at eight, but I was early, ready at two a.m. But I'm trading in my one I have currently, and. I will do an unboxing when it comes next week. I 
I love the new feature on it. Um, that's why I mainly wanted it. Plus, I was out of storage. So, and a when you trade your phone in, you get like almost more than half of it back, or about half. I think it said I was gonna get like 700 back for my phone, or 600. I think it was 700. So that's like half of the new phone. Which I know it's like ridiculously priced, but I also use it for work, my camera, all of that stuff. And there's a new feature on it where if you have no service or if your phone is turned off, you can still, people can still see your location. So if you were in a place with no service and you need help or any of that, you can't find people, your friends at a concert, you have no service, It'll still work to see their location. I love that. So safe. Me and my uncle. My uncle, my dad, and my brother. We're all very into technology. He gets the new one every single year too. And he's always like talking about it, like, oh, you getting the new phone too? We've all always been like huge into all that stuff. My brother like codes websites and all of that. So it definitely like runs in the family. <laughs> Mm. I don't know what I like the best. So I got a three pack. I did a Sam's Club haul on my second channel. It came with Nashville hot, buffalo, and um, a honey teriyaki. So I was excited to try out these other ones. I needed buffalo to make buffalo chicken dip. And then I saw this three pack. I'm like, ooh, Nashville hot. Those KFC chicken fingers. Ooh, this one's thick. Wow, thick. Let's see. Mmm. Very good. I like that a lot. It almost just tastes like regular Frank's, but more like peppery. You can see in the bottle, like it's got so many black specks in it. More seasoning. Mmm. I want to go to Mr. Beast restaurant. I don't know where it is. Probably LA. I have like no interest to go to LA anymore. Like the few social media people I've met, not all of them, but a big handful, they're all like fake and like only care about like views and stuff. Like I am not like that. And I feel like everyone in LA is not everyone, but I don't like that. Like where they just are so like your their egos are just so high and they only care about views and being the most famous. Like I don't want that. Like I'm just a normal person who you guys are like my friends and we eat together. And I like to try out new things and I'm filming it. And I enjoy making videos and editing them, all of that. I've been doing it since I was eight years old. So But like that's not like I'm like not just trying to get ahead of everyone like not at all I don't like that like I would never want to live there when I was younger I did for sure but now that I'm getting older and more mature I see what it's like really like not my vibe I would totally live like in Florida or like somewhere by the beach Virginia um, but I'm happy here Mmm, it is busy today. 
You guys see all the traffic behind me? I'm like facing the store too and nothing bunt cakes. Ooh, dessert. Ooh, these are spicy. Mmm. I haven't had those in a while. Oh my gosh, they're spicy. And there's just so many people going in and out of Wingstop. I've kind of parked in a bad spot. Everyone's just staring at me. Hi. Just chowing down on some wings. <laughs> Look how cute my new cup is. I swear I was saying this earlier, but I didn't tell you guys where I got it from. Etsy. They have the best, cutest cups, and they're not that expensive. And, like, the stickers stay on. I shop from so many different people on Etsy that make these. But if you just look up Starbucks, this is what I looked up. Starbucks Fall Cup. You'll see this one. It's so cute. And you can, like, put your name on it, too, if you want. But I love these cups. It makes drinking water so much fun. It doesn't keep, like, your ice cold or whatever. But I don't know. I like them. They're lightweight and they fit in your cup holder. Well guys, I am very full. Uh, that sandwich was, it's amazing. It is amazing. You have to try it for sure. Get your favorite wing flavor on it. I'm sure, uh, I would, I wish I could have tried another one too. They had so many flavors, like, but garlic parm I think is my like all time favorite, so. But yeah, I highly recommend that sandwich. Like, if you have a wing stop nearby, go get it and even if it says it's out of stock on the app maybe call because that's what I did and maybe they'll have it and just get your favorite wing flavor on it so juicy Woo! dip it in some ranch or blue cheese whatever you like I like ranch and some corn corn for the corn kid this one's for you <laughs> Well, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you all have a great Friday and a fun weekend, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.